I think I speak for a lot of boys when I say this, but a lot of middle school to maybe teen, high school uh, boys during 2016 era of YouTube used to look up to uh, Leafy is here. He had a very prominent run on uh, YouTube, especially with his uh, commentary videos of him essentially just making fun of people or poking fun at certain groups of people. And I think it's really sad to see this era of YouTube kind of diminishing. I think the last couple people was probably Max Mofo and even them. They, they moved on to podcasting, which is completely fine. iDubs is nowhere to be seen. He's uh, doing his own thing, still making YouTube, but kind of straying away from it, uh, doing more boxing, which is, you know, good for him once again. But unfortunately, Leafy has never changed, and he is, in fact, still fucking here. <laughs> Leafy truly has never left. He has always been here. I think people have just neglected him. Being blacklisted on YouTube definitely kept him out of the limelight, but um, with many things uh, such as cockroaches or ants or uh, spiders, they always fucking manage to come back. Uh, no matter how many times you squash them, they will come back. Now, no hate to Leafy. You know, I, I take a lot of idea and inspirations from him especially with my surfing videos and i typically don't have a filter you know i say what i want to say but to a certain degree uh what i say is normal what leafy did differently was essentially ruining his uh, reputation as a human being and any job offer that has ever been given to him has just been fucking shoved into the depths of fucking hell at this point but recently if you haven't seen this picture for some reason um or just aren't on twitter or fucking x whatever the fuck you want to call it at this point but leafy posted a face reveal for 2023 for the second fucking time why did he do it a second time i don't know leafy has warranted so much bad attention to him that it's not even worth trying to keep his image straight up deleting everything and making a whole new persona where you don't have to show your face is probably the best course of action as of right now you know it's bad when ricky berwick is uh posting a joke video about you i want to fondle your facial hair why would you want to warrant this type of attention uh leafy definitely had one of the best runs on youtube that anyone has ever seen um but it warranted so much bad attention that he has somehow embodied the person that he used to make fun of it's actually kind of sad to see a youtuber that was so highly praised become the bottom of the barrel internet meme it's like growing up with someone from middle school and seeing them fall into the depths of fucking hell in high school uh he used to he used to have a glow in his face he used to be happy look at look at this young man this is a happy boy this is this is youtuber making hella money doing what he wants and then it somehow turned into this what the fuck is this now when i first saw this i couldn't tell if it was a joke maybe it's photoshopped maybe it's not i don't know God, I hope it was. This shit is taking up more storage on my fucking computer than all the games I have combined. I think I need to go on Amazon and find a 20 terabyte fucking hard drive so I could fit this image on my fucking computer at this point. Now, if you thought this entire video was going to be about that picture, then you are sadly mistaken because Leafy truly has never left. What I mean by that is that he has not changed like the people that I mentioned earlier. Unlike iDubs or MaxMofo, where they strayed into different forms of uh, media, even Filthy Frank, for example, they have grown as human beings and realized how much uh, that, that era of YouTube was not good for them. They are warranting so much bad attention to themselves and I really want to show this little clip from iDubs. It's from his uh, interview with Anthony Padilla. Another thing that ended up um, kind of guiding the path a little bit, I did not like the interactions that I had with fans. There were quite a few human beings that I interacted with. In person? That, yeah, in person, that just sucked. iDubs has grown as a human being, but somehow Leafy is still the 20 year old making fun of people and certain groups of people, but they, he, he's amped it up by like 7 million. Now, a lot of these comments I can't show because it's some of the worst fucking comments I've ever read in my life. Uh, take this one, for example, you know, by all means, you can have your own opinion, but you can clearly tell that he is trying to do it for attention rather than entertainment like he did on YouTube. Obviously, to some degree, I'm sure he does mean some of the things that he says, uh, but calling yourself the Hitler of the LGBTQ community, uh, you're doing it for attention. He is still living in the 2016 era of YouTube, but without YouTube. He has moved on to other forms of social media to attack people and 
still be the 20 year old making fucking leafy is here videos i only make this video because i used to look up to leafy and i take a lot of inspiration from him even i have grown as a fucking human being from my 13 year old self that used to watch him and i think it's really sad to see this embodiment of what i used to watch still being here and reminding me every day of how much a cunt that i used to be anyways new surf video coming out soon probably a couple days i don't know we'll see anyways i hope you guys have a good day